Good morning, everyone. I hope you're doing really well today. So, we just had Halloween a few days back, and I thought I would make a video about a place I've been hanging out a lot in World of Warcraft called the Weeping Cave. So, the Weeping Cave is a cave filled with bog beasts and oozes. It's also the location of a rare spawn elemental named the Husk. The cave is located in northeastern area of Western Plaguelands, just west of the Fondrill River. <laughs> I can't even pronounce that. The rotting bear moths and decaying horror mobs inside the cave have a very low chance, about a 3% chance in fact, of dropping greater nature protection potion recipe so you're either gonna have to buy this recipe or you're gonna have to go and farm here on my server currently these are selling for around about 50 to 70 gold with an average being about 60 gold the oozes have about a one in ten chance of dropping a bag which quite often contains money as well as rare items Although the main reason you want to come here is for Bog Beasts, with their 3% Greater Nature Protection Potion drop. I also really like this area because there are some large Thorian veins here, and if you don't know, the average respawn time on these Thorian veins is around about 15 to 16 minutes. So if you spend an hour farming here, you should get around about 4 Greater Thorian veins which all have a possibility of dropping an arcane crystal. So far, I've been hiding in this cave and I've been getting an arcane crystal roughly every hour and a half. Now this cave is actually very nice if you are the only person farming here. Even if there's two people, that's not really a problem. As long as you get to the large Thorian veins first and managed to mine them. Again, farming here, I've had four Greater Nature Protection Potions drop, all of which have gone for about 60 gold each. So all, all in all, you should be making roughly about 150 gold an hour, I would say, if you're lucky. If you're not lucky, you could obviously make far less. Anyway, this cave is quite a nice place just to get away from everyone for a little while and live in a cave. And let's face it, this is probably the closest you're going to get to Minecraft in World of Warcraft. The other nice thing about this cave is there's quite a lot of platforms that you can jump onto. So for example, if you want to wait for a Thorium vein to spawn, and bear in mind the spawn time is about 16 minutes, then you can literally hop on a platform, log back in in 16 minutes, have a wander around and see if it's spawned yet. This is actually quite a good strategy for finding arcane crystals without too much risk. Well, thank you very much, everyone. I really hope you enjoy your trip into the spooky cave. I also hope that you had a happy Halloween. Oh, see you guys soon.